Welcome to the boob tube. I am the breast doc and hormone rebel because you can't treat estrogen dominance with more estrogen, right? That's not gonna work. How does that make sense? It doesn't. So today I wanna to talk about, we were talking about passion and how to increase that. And the number one surefire sign of low testosterone is loss of libido or passion. And uh, there's a few ways to go about uh, raising your testosterone. Um, you can get the pellets, they're fabulous. Uh, my patients love them. They can't stop talking about them. They're like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad you said that. This changed my life. They're happy again. Their husband calls me and thanks me. <laughs> so I always, I love, I love talking about testosterone because it's, it's, it, it's a, you get the results a lot more quickly and uh, everyone loves the results of testosterone. You get a little bit more energy, but number one is the passion and we wanna get that back for you. Um, there's another way to apply testosterone for women. Men are completely different. I do a whole different thing on men too is um, cream. Now the reason why, pellets versus cream. Uh, the pellets, you can't control the amount. And some women, we're all a little different. A little different. I'm 50, so I'm just applying a little bit of testosterone right now, and I use a cream. Um, just to see how I go into, I'm not menopausal yet, but just to see how I slide into it. I don't want to lose my passion, so I'm just kind of using a little bit to keep it up there. Uh, and that's what I like to do. I like to uh, make it my own, uh, my own amount and how I have to listen to my body to understand what's going on. And that's what I'm always reminding you guys. Listen to your body. How are you reacting to that hormone? That's why I don't like a lot of times to use a lot of supplements. I'm very anti-supplement. I want to use something that I know is working. And I'm... I guess I want to say my anti-supplement, I'm anti-400 supplements. I want very specific supplements that I can feel the difference or I know that's working. With testosterone, that's the same thing. Sometimes I like to get some of my patients on just progesterone or just testosterone and then we'll move back and forth and see how they're doing. Some people are like, I'm just ready for a change. Give it to me. I can do that too. I'll help you with that also. So why I like the cream over the pellets, this is why is because you take a little click and uh, it's just one click you put it on your little finger index ring whatever but it's applied directly to the clitoris guess what there's no receptors for testosterone floating around in our arms our tummy um, our legs anything like that you're going to maximize your treatment by putting it exactly where it's required and that is on the clitoris um, you'll have a little bit of cream left over so i do kind of rub it up and down the lips or the labia too but I really try to get it on that clitoris. And what's also very strange is you feel it. <laughs> I don't know how to explain that. It has like a little sensation that you feel and you're like, well, I think that's working. Yeah, it is. So with my patients, I always like to say, um, listen to your body because um, I don't know how to say this other than listen to your body and you'll just understand what I'm saying it. So what you're gonna, uh, what you're gonna do is you're gonna apply it every single day for like one week, two weeks, three weeks, four weeks, and then around week four, you're gonna be like, oh my God, okay, I understand what she's saying, all right? It'll happen. And some, you'll, you might go a little bit too much, and that's fine, so don't worry about that, because uh, we're controlling the amount, remember? So you'll, you, like, I got a little bit of excess acne right here, and we all have like little chin hairs, but I felt like they were faster, and they like grew in more, and I'm like, ah, okay, that was too much. Back off. Take a week off, okay? Because let's just uh, rebal uh, rebalance ourselves or find uh, homeostasis again. So, um, uh, and you might get like a little irritated too, so that could be the testosterone also. Um, so back off, then apply it like Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Ooh, too much. Okay, Monday, Wednesday. Uh, you know, like find your time or just on the weekends and stuff like that. So that's why right now I'm just applying it every once in a while and it keeps my libido up and stuff. So that's how I know. So with testosterone, again, little bit of click, apply to the clitoris as needed. And I wish you all the best and let me know how you like it, um, and especially your husband is very let me know.